I fumbling. apologize. It was, it was, it was pretty loud. <laughs> but now it's on the correct side, at least. That was pretty loud. Uh, so we got Bomb Boy Okay. I don't know. Not Bomb Fair anymore. It's too easy. I guess we'll just be down air up air. We'll just do that. Down ever, air ever, up air. We did that twice that game. Yeah. All right, but we're going in. We've got the beefy cheese enchilada. <laughs> uh, that should I'm be the serious. name. That, is, that, that was their name for multiple uh, times. Ooh. They are Beefos and Master Chiefs, who are number two and five, respectively, on the uh, Fargo PR. Awesome. Uh, versus Fife uh, and Rhino. Dead. Wow, okay, that was an SD. That's never what you like to see. So they started on FD, which is kind of peculiar because even when people do typically strike, they usually go to like Battlefield or Town and City. Because FD is considered to be super, like, not neutral for certain characters. Oh, for sure. I guess people feel confident in their characters. <laughs> there are a lot of good doubles characters here, except uh, Korn is not really one of them, but. Nice little, uh. Nice little combo there from Kifos and Chilada. Ooh, the forward smash. Oh my gosh. Already down two stock. stocks. Bifos Last gets stop. spiked and SDs. It has not been a minute. It has just now been a minute, and he's on his last side. Everybody else still on their third, but this is certainly doable so long as they kind of keep their cool. You know, maybe Bifos just needs to stay back, especially in this team. I I foresee Corrin being the support character, going for the up airs to kill confirm, going for the back airs. Hmm. Uh, just narrowing to get them back to Pikachu. Uh, gonna take out the the cloud. So now we're sitting five stocks to three. Soon to probably be four stocks. I grab, just grab them out of that dragon lunge. Oh my mm -hmm. gosh! Go for the spike. He's crazy. Crazy. Boy. He's gonna go for the butt, uh, the cape. I think. Oh, Ephos barely beating out that forward smash with that nair. That would have been a really big deal. Every bit of percentage is super important right now when you're in here, especially when you're dealing with this last stock situation. Yeah. Pikachu is your partner, so it's not like you can trust your teammate to be able to stock tank. Mm -hmm. Down tilt, do. run in, up smash, no air dodge, no nothing. Uh, that's a big club. Uh, hey, you know, all of a sudden this looks a little bit more doable. Let's, you know, they take out the Mario. Is that back throw going to do it? Yeah, back throw's gonna do it. Rage back throw. Alright. So there was a little bit of a drop juggle there, especially while the opponents are dead. That's kind of when you want to really gang up on the, on yeah, the you, other opponent. You really want to go in to type that extra, extra percent. Because you, you're just not going to be interrupted by it all. Because especially if you get the star KO, that's when stuff gets super easy. You get like four or five free seconds to do whatever you want before they come in with invincibility. Footstool. <laughs> Probably on purpose. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, ooh. Not going to quite do it, though. That's always unfortunate to see. Because you know their intentions. <gasps> oh, the fire stops that. But the forward smash to the ledge is going to take it. Scored right off stage. So Master Chief has a big deficit that's here, it. and that's gonna do it. You know, Good I don't think grab. I like that. I don't grab. think they were need to make a lot of adjustments to take game two. Uh, at twenty four percent SD is super unfortunate, and then you kind of just sometimes get spiked at like fifty. Yeah, it that's happens. kind of the nature of doubles. There's yeah. a lot going on. Yeah, that's the kind of thing that'll happen. If he, uh, I think if he, if they clean it up, it's gonna be a much closer game and. They could take a game. Maybe this set. Team composition is obviously to their disadvantage because while Pikachu and Corrin are both solid team characters, Mario Kart is likely like at least top three team comps you can have. I feel like that's the best. I, I agree. <laughs> I think it is also the best. With Mario's great grab and combo game and just ability to give Cloud everything he needs. It's right. It's there. Like, and they both have vertical juggles, but Mario's is vertical and he follows them like horizontally. Whereas Cloud is just straight juggle. It's kind of crazy. Mm -hmm. You've got this lovely lobby music. Mm. 
fucking say something. I love when uh, I love when the corns are like in the beginning of a match. It started with the pin right there. I think, I think he might have done that last match, but did it catch his? Uh, I wasn't paying attention. Really, was did Rhino just try to run in right away? Uh, no, no, I think he just stood there. But the thing is about that pin is that like even if you don't hit somebody with it, <laughs> it creates the pressure because they have so many options out of it. Yeah, mostly offensive options, but yeah. there is still the cancel and the jump. Yep. Which jump can be offensive if the person jumps with you? Oh, that was a back throw, huh? That was odd. Nice that she's not throwing to his uh, teammate there. Oh. Rhino reading the aggressive option there with that up smash. Oh, oh, that would have been oh. a dead cloud. I think that I thought I would have taken it. Maybe. Mm. I don't know if quite yet. Not no. a, not a lot of rage. So. No. He's gonna burn his limit right there, though. That's good. Good for the green team. Beef and cheese. This cloud is definitely now at a whole lot of Gosh. kill defense. Like, Pikachu can do drag down F tilt. That pin. Yeah, that pin. Yeah. Dragon lunge. And obviously, Corrin's got the kill throws. Every character on the screen right now has some form of kill throw, which I believe is super important in doubles because a lot of times there will be just one player who's living for way too long. Yeah. And right when that person just keeps living, that's when games turn around quickly because they don't lose their stock. And then all of a sudden, you think, oh, damage-wise, we're oh, doing wow. just fine. But you're not. They're not, uh, I can, I see beef and cheese. Is that, uh, beef and cheese are not throwing to each other. No, uh, That's essential. You need to do that. Especially oh with these two behind, that was, And it worked. Okay. Wow. I think he rolled, like, three or four times right to the, to the edge of the stage. Hey, that was a good read by Fife, though. <laughs> you know, interestingly enough, though, both these characters have, like, throws that are, like, okay, but aren't, like, godlike for doubles. But one thing is that I think is super important is their, uh, Pikachu's ability to save his teammates. Oh, that was a great confirm there from Beefos. Ooh, we almost had that air dodge. Jab? No. I think I, uh, I think I would have preferred if he had chased out there and... Master Chief had covered the cloud and kept him off of him. Yeah. Because a back air, like off of an air dodge read, or maybe even just kind of raw, would have been a really big deal right there. Certainly. It's kind of what a lot of uh, doubles matches seem to come down to is how many or who gets the most amount of early stocks. So, yeah, that can that can determine the outcome. Master Chief thought about following him up with the thunder there. Good air dodge from Rhino. Timing it correctly is to not get hit by the actual thunder itself. Yeah. I think uh, Fife needs to hang back and charge limit, like just like that one. See, well, right. I guess I can understand he'd want to go up and uh, punish uh, whatever the opposing team is doing to his teammate, but mm -hmm. I think he needs to get more limit, like more limit confirms. That's not going to do it. Bifos definitely just kind of left Master Chief to get hit by the cloud there. That's The moment your teammate's in trouble, I get it, you do want to end the Mario stock but you've got to save your teammates. Getting yeah. them out of those sticky situations causes your team to lose less stocks. Yeah. <laughs> that's that got that dragon. That was an SD at 5%. Oh. Both these games dictated almost like, especially if they had uh, taken that down, this would have been a, in their favor if they take down Beefos or Master G's at this percent. Yeah. Oh, that was good waiting. Do a forward throw too. That had a lot of invincibility on it. So now there's a lot. There's a couple things that would end this game immediately, like a Pikachu grab for footstool and like jab stuff, uh, and obviously not super necessary as you can kind of just like juggle them. But when it comes to Cloud, it's those quick combos. You just want to take care of them because up air from yes. both these characters does it, and then that's when some stupid Cloud stuff happens. Yeah, he's, he's he's kind of bringing us back here. Those those uh, four smashes though, he can't be having any more of those. Oh. Kills his teammate. See, and this I, is what I mean right here. Master he, Chief's the kill percent. Ooh. I think he was he was trying to definitely combo off that dragon lunge, but mm -hmm. oh my gosh, what is this this movement? Now I'll be honest, I did not see that coming. Actually, I did not think the, he would jump just across short the there. Yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Good work from Beef and Cheese to bring that back.
Well, certainly, you know, and I think both SDs. teams... Yeah. SDs keep happening. They gotta stop. If SDs, you know, they dictate these sets, that's not the kind of sets you really like. No. But then again, I kind of do like it. I like to see Jank. I like that. Uh, that's not really Jank. I mean, but we, we take do, those, though. You do take those. But Jank... <sighs> the world is a crazy place. And sometimes... Just go out like a buster. No, sometimes you just gotta pay cloud. <laughs> That's how it sometimes. <laughs> no, don't That's remind me. It's, it's a crazy place, man. You know, double tune link. It's a harsh <laughs> world out there, so man, you just gotta pay cloud. All right, just because we're on commentary, we don't have to talk about ourselves the whole time. The whole time, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> just some of the time. Game three, battlefield. This is doubles losers top eight, and the timer says it's 7:57. Is beef and cheese versus Ryan one five. <laughs> This, oh, very good damage. Just already starting off from uh, Fife there, hitting off of Rhino's combos and off of the opponent's uh, stray hits. Maybe we'll see an SD in the coming game. Maybe. maybe. I would hope so. I would I'm going to have faith <laughs> in these players. They are all very solid. Oh, that was, invincibility that, stopped that. that uh, gosh, mm. what is that called? It's it's the dra uh, it's the dragon shot. Yeah. But I think it would have actually been smarter to either hold on or wait for the grab release because then Pikachu is stunned and he can get an even bigger punish. Oh, by that's like true. Up smashing. Yeah. Maybe just start starting more up airs. All right. Oh, catches that get up. Amazing that's read by Five. <laughs> uh, yeah. Limit cross slash covers a lot of options there. Um, oh, he just fireballed his own opponent. He's like. Don't don't charge limit. We could right. do it without it. So right there, uh, Fife just kind of stood there. He didn't charge or do anything. But when you're cloud, if you're if you've got the distance, you you charge. Oh yeah, you charge. They can't get these stocks, so I think that's gonna cost them. I think we're gonna see some uh, rage shenanigans going on right here. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Just about everybody at kill percent. Cloud is yeah. kind of the only one that might not die every time. And shields that. No one can take the stocks right now. Mario's up smashing. Cloud's up airing. That. Corn's not going to do it. No one's taking the stock right now. Oh, but the forwards. Oh, the up smash from Pikachu there. And the back. Wow. I was expecting Beefos to have to hit the up air off of that, but yeah. guess not. They were originally in the disadvantage, but now they've taken the first stocks. First stocks are huge in doubles. They're obviously big in singles, but I feel like in doubles, if you get that early stock advantage, things become way easier. Yeah. But all of a sudden, the opponent has to start fishing for kills. He's looking for the back throw hard right now. <laughs> oh, great. Great short hop down there. I don't know if that was a double stick. I don't know if... Uh, well, good job shielding that, uh, that back throw. That would have killed him, actually. <laughs> Great job air dodging through that. A lot of people yeah. don't air dodge through like the down air. Yeah, exactly. I can't believe. But it. there are so few characters where it's like 100% true, or you can't act out in some way. Okay, that goes uh, five up smashes in a row. You see six? No, it's a down. He smash. Just down smashes, knowing five that the up. invincibility wasn't going to help him. I did not see what. Did, what just happened to Cloud? Uh, he tried to recover to the ledge, and Pikachu just down smashed on the ledge, knowing that he wasn't going to perfectly snap. Oh, nice. Oh, he can up be out of that. Okay, that's no longer. Mm -hmm. That's no longer good. Once you know that kind of information. This is game three, though, so that adaptation might not actually even come in handy. Now, we're not seeing a lot of... Oh. Just as I was about to say, we're not <laughs> seeing a lot of Mario or Cloud combos on Battlefield, which it's known for. Uh, we almost see uh, Pikachu get carried to the top. And there's another up B. All right. So now at this point, this is kind of where they say, you know what, we kind of have to start maybe start fishing for it a little bit, get these limit kills, yeah. cross slash or finishing touch. Mario's throws are so perfect, particularly back throw and forward throw are just gorgeous setups for those moves. Uh, I think Five really needs to hang on to the stock. Uh, a share stock will really cost a blue team right now. Mm -hmm. uh, I think if, limit, if he did limit cross slasher, that would have uh, killed, I believe. Instead of a dash attack. Players are rolling to in <laughs> panic mode rather oh, than yes. choosing to stick to the air and hoping their uh, teammate covers them. And up is going to do it. Very committal up air from oh, Fife right there. Definitely could have had a little bit of hard He's dead. Is that it? Yep. Oh, okay. Rhino tried to get over there. Share stock. Quick. Oh, boy. Oh, that's not good. Oh, but he got sent the correct way. He hit his jump. Wow, okay. I didn't know that. Nice Definitely step. a hard game, and that's... All right. Beef and cheese. Got to hold on to this. If anyone's going to bring it back, I think it would be Cloud. 
So let's see it happen. Mm -hmm. Fife, really? don't let me down. I like Beefo's how he's trying to get in their face, and then Master Cheese is trying to cover every defensive option because down air is so large. I don't know about that forward throw. I get See, the idea. That's the thing. I, that's, that's what I was saying. Uh, this whole set, they haven't really been uh, throwing mm -hmm. to each other. I think that that can cost them. They could be stealing stock, uh, stocks much quicker because of that, but they're not. Cool. Oh, that nice. could have been. That could have been something. Oh. Maybe that was the moment where you get up on that platform and up smash instead. Mm -hmm. All right, no limit. Things just became a lot easier. Now all they got to do is kill. Down tilt, up there, not doing it. Bring it back. Bring Fife's it back. Fife's really trying to hold on to this, but that pin is going to take it. Man, he would have. That was just poor DI. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Beef and Cheese take it 2 1 over uh, Good Fife game to them, and though. Fife Good and games. Rhino. Yeah. GG's. We were up early.